Um, welcome to your Gold Market Update Charts of the Day for today, 19th of April 2023. Mike Smith, Senior Analyst at Gold Markets, to lead you around what's happening in markets today. Overnight in the US, we had a choppy session as major indices all closed near neutral. US earnings season and the Fed in focus. Some slight mixed messages from some of the FOMC members overnight. Probably just twitch markets a little bit. US futures are just below neutral in early Asian session and of course Asian markets are mixed but cautious. ASX is trending near neutral slightly to the upside as we're recording this material stocks are way outperforming the rest of the 11 sectors. European markets are pointing to a positive open and the VIX continues to drop to 15 month lows. US dollar index edges lower again remains in that downward trend channel we've been talking about for some time. As a result of that, gold held the key 2000 level in a choppy but positive session. And we've got 2014 as a level to keep an eye on. And all traded near neutral. Bitcoin moved back over 30,000 and looks to test resistance again at multi-month highs. And of course, US earnings remain in focus uh, on the data front. We've got UK PPI and CPI. Inflation data also out of the Eurozone. We've got EIA stock levels and the Fed's beige book report. Those are the data highlights. Plenty for the markets once again to digest. Let's have a look at a couple of charts that caught our eye this morning. In the FX world, the Aussie yen is looking pretty strong. We've got a technical double bottom going on on the daily chart. You can see that 200 MA is sitting just around about 91 cents. If we just bring this to an hourly chart. We suspect we may well test that today, that 91 cent level. So there is a short term potential opportunity, perhaps of around 50 pips or so up to that level. Uh, and if we breach it, then that's when I think that might precipitate some buying pressure. So one worth keeping an eye on during the course of the day if we continue to see some yen weakness. On the ASX, Pilbara Minerals looks very strong. You can see again that technical double bottom using the 200 EMA as a confirmation point. This was our chart of the day yesterday. And you can see it pushed strongly through in today's session. So that target of around about 440 looks really on the cards at this stage. Trade safe and we'll see you again soon. Bye bye for now.